praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Beloved, today we are going to read and understand a very beautiful psalm, Psalm 2, for the blessings and also for the coronation of the Lord's anointed. There are abundance of blessings and also peace and joy and happiness and prosperity in the presence of our mighty God. Receive the blessings as we read Psalm 2 and all the bondages will be broken down right now in the name of Jesus of Nazareth. Also, we pray for Jesus Christ. You are and you are Prince of Peace. Bless each of my listeners with peace and joy and happiness. Coronation of the Lord anointed Psalm 2. Why do the nations rage and the people plot away the king? The kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed day. Let us break their bonds in the pieces and cast away their cords from us. He who sits in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord shall hold them in derision. Then he shall speak to them in his wrath and distress them in his deep displeasure. Yet I have set my king on my holy hill of Zion. I will declare the decree the Lord has set to me. You are my son. Today I have begotten you. Ask of me and I will give you the nation for your inheritance and the ends of the earth for your possession. You shall break them with a rod of iron. You shall dash them in pieces like a bottle vessel. Now, then, be wise. Okay. Be instructed. You judges of the earth. Serve the Lord with fear and rejoice with trembling. Kiss the sun lest he be angry and you perish in the way when his wrath is kindled but a little blessed are all those who put their trust in him amen amen be blessed today and every day remember lord jesus christ loves you and me and be encouraged do not quit in life do not give up in life for the battle is the lord's 1 samuel 17 verse 14 and the victory rests with our mighty god rocks 21 verse 21 is true the food is god yes amen amen